Well, we're just getting loaded here to head to Kansas and Oklahoma. All right, let's go. Well, here we are. First stop near White Cloud, Kansas. In case you guys didn't know it, we got some visitors with us. Uh, yep. Oh, sorry, lights. Oh, Lexi. Look at this thing! So we got a 430 bushel cart. This actually came out of Montana and uh, they paired it with a 40 foot, I believe, 1990 CCS drill. They got the Intelligent Ag Wireless blockage system here, as you can see. He said that's really telling them that it's flowing. They had a lot of issues before that, so that was one of the most valuable things that they picked up this last year and added to their drill. This is they put on all stainless steel meter housings and top to bottom rebuild. I know that company. As well as the hydraulic drive variable rate kit here. So we are uh, changing the seal out. And uh, these are our new stainless steel manifolds that we're testing out. Nathan's one of the few farmers that's still running this time of year. And we were driving by, so we decided to try to mount it up to his tank and see what it does in the field. Hey guys. Hi. Are you cold? Uh, we're just watching. Oh, you're watching a movie. Spirit. See ya. So we're gonna be changing out these plastic manifolds, which are from John Deere. Hi Dad, what can I help with? What can you help with? Yeah. Well, you're doing a great job of yeah. being Happy? Yeah. <laughs> so we've got the uh, lower dropped. There's nothing wrong with this one. This is our stainless steel, but it's got the John Deere plastic manifolds. And Jesse's finishing up putting the stainless steel manifolds in from ready. Check that out. Huh? Well, Nathan, what do you think of this? Looks good to me. Pretty looks, shiny. Yeah, looks good. Hopefully it works good, right? Maybe All right, Nathan. Might need your help. Where at? Just to put a nut up here. Well, we are finally ready to run here. We just got the uh, tubes mounted and got some hydraulics cleaned up here. We think we had a leak in this plug, but for safe measure, we also changed one of the adapters. So what we got going on here is the stainless steel manifolds that we're going to try today and got the S-tubes, straight tubes back in place. We've got the Romapa individual run shutoff meter housings and their section control linear actuators here. And we're going to get to see that going in a few short minutes. Should we do it? So. Try? All right. We can't wait anymore. <laughs> No more delay. Who's excited to be here? I don't know. Uh, not me. You don't really know what here is? Are we at the hotel? No, no. hotel. We are at Exapta. Oh, Exapta is going to be a new partner solution for us. We're collaborating on a few products, so stay tuned for that. With that, uh, we'll go in and check things out. We got some parts for them, some stabilizers, 
and uh, we're gonna pick up some gauge wheel tires hopefully for the ride back. We'll check back with you in a little bit. Well, we're continuing on our journey here. We're gonna do a quick customer visit. The guy that we helped sell some stainless parts to. Here he's got his case, cart, and drill right in this oil well site. And we're gonna take a peek at it and meet him and see some things that he needs done to it. How you guys doing? You guys enjoying your road trip? Yeah. Yeah, what's your favorite part so far? Watching um, movies. Watching movies? Yeah. What else? I don't know. Eating hot chocolate. Getting some hot chocolate. Some snacks. Snacks, yeah, those are all good. Being with your daddy. Oh yeah, visiting farmers. Visiting farmers, of course. That is really fun part of going on road trips. The other wonderful thing about it down here, guys, it is 65 degrees. Right now in Fargo, where we're from, it is minus 20. So you got about almost a Almost an 80 to 90 degree temperature difference here and we're just loving it. So excited to, to be down here, visiting a little family, visiting farmers. So let's take a look at what we're gonna do here. So this is the case ADX 3380 with a hoe drill attached to it. Uh, this customer had a really unfortunate thing happen. This front caster wheel system actually broke right here and the entire wheel assembly went right through the bottom undercarriage and completely wrecked and damaged this whole undercarriage system. And even though the, the undercarriage, the air system wasn't corroded, it just destroyed and damaged it so bad that it had to be replaced. So he contacted us and we got some stainless all set up for him. Uh, it, it was a lower cost and he had the benefits of stainless. The challenge now though is there's still some leaking issues and it could be related to some of the early damage that happened to it. So we're going to take a peek here and just see if there's anything we can help figure out here and improve. Well what a change a few days makes. It is like 10 degrees and we're in Fairview, Oklahoma. We're visiting our cousins here and uh, the kids are going to jump into the tractor and go feed the cows. So enjoy that time with them. Oh, look at a dog. You excited? Yeah. What are you going to do? I'm going to feed some cows. How are you, Dad? I'm great, buddy. Thanks for asking. I'm going to go in and have some coffee. Okay. All right, see you back here. Hi. Hi, Talia. How are you? Good. What are we doing? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> Where do I sit? Oh. Did you actually move? We just said goodbye to our family here in Fairview, Oklahoma. Just a really good treat to, to visit them. And we, we just are bummed that we don't get to stay longer. We always feel like it's rushed, but we got to get home tonight. And we got 13 hours with no stops, which we are going to stop. So it'll probably take 15 hours. We're going to get back on the road and we'll be back to ready here shortly. Did you guys have fun? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Cool. All right. Onward. 
Oklahoma sky with North Dakota snow. Well, we are here in Council Bluffs, Iowa, or Omaha, Nebraska, neighboring city. And uh, we're stopping at the uh, good old Texas Roadhouse, getting something to go. Let's see how this goes, eating it in the car. What do you think? You think we're gonna have some success? Yeah. Yeah. How many spills do you think we'll have? A Who's got to guess? A lot? I'm going to guess Lexi's going to get one. Oh, low blow. Naming names. I think Russell's going to get one. Russell? All right. Uh, what about Daddy? Or your Daddy? <laughs> He'll get lots of spills. Hey, guys. Thanks for watching. <laughs> God bless. Blessings on your new year. We really appreciate you, and thanks for tracking with us. And hopefully we can have an adventure at your farm someday if you're a farmer. And otherwise, maybe meet you at a farm show. Whatever it takes, we uh, really appreciate you and love you. God bless.